Hello everyone, welcome back to some more E4. So yeah, some more White Elephant. Um, last episode, got bored, just declared war. You know, as you do. Um, they're getting a bit buggered, so I'll get rid of them, don't need them. Because Ava's picking up again. Um, but yeah, we're basically just sitting, but still sitting back, making money, and um, we're not making money off me anymore, but that don't matter. Because we can make money by just not funding the army. We're almost full on cannons. I think we are building more cannons, or we started building cannons last episode, yeah we did. Are we building two there? Just one. Hmm, huh, just one. Ah, there's the other one. But yeah, we you know, just got a lot of sitting around to do still, because I'm trying to catch up on economic, so I can dev push um, colonialism in... Bangkok, not Bangkok, it was one of these. Ray, pay it, Rayon, Rayon. Oh, I forgot to turn that off. There we go. Uh, but yeah, Rayon, I think is where we're going to dev. I don't know. Where's the cheapest? There. We could do there. And it's cheaper to build in it. But this gives more. Uh... Ah well, I'll figure it out once we get to it really, won't I? Um, soon we're going to get go into Malacca and go into Diviet. Diviet probably more urgently in quotation marks because, you know, that gives us a better opportunity to get all this. Um, we're much stronger than Bengal. As I said, with I'm surprised how many soldiers we were actually able to field. I mean, yeah, I know we got quantity, but it's a lot more than I thought it was. Also, we just lost our claim on Khmer. Might want that back. Um, we can get rid of this spy network. We're getting claims, but we're not going to use them for a long while. <laughs> but yeah, we're, n we're not at the deving phase yet, so there's no real need to be able to build any of this. Aside from workshops, because workshops make you a lot of money. But yeah, we're going to sit around for a bit more. Ooh, Age of Reformation. Literally just fired. We've converted provinces. Um, none, of, none of the rest. But yeah, I'll be like right back once we have finished economic. Now, I know I said I'd wait until I'd, you know, taken full economic ideas to dev push the institution. But I'm doing it anyway, or I've done it anyway. It's cost me quite a little, quite a little bit of points, and I'm gonna do that. And there we go. There it is. I dev, dev pushed the second institution because sitting and waiting for it is would just take forever. I'd be sat here for like oh, it's just forever waiting for it to tick over. So there, there we go. Now it's going. And we'll be able to embrace that very soon. I also want to move the fort from Pegu. So from there to Martaban. Or whatever that's. Martaban. But I'll put it in Martaban because that's a jungle. And that'll, and it's a river crossing. So it'll give an extra two. Or it'll get, give an extra minus two to anyone attacking or, or sieging it. Which is going to be proper handy. I tell you, I'm probably going to lose some innovativeness, which is going to make me a little bit upset, but, you know, just a little bit. But then, then, and yeah, Ming, Ming not helping, Ming not helping, Ming taking all our points. But yeah, we'll almost get, we've almost got economic, and then we can start taking everything up, and then, then it'll all be right as rain, and rosy. Be nice, happy, that. Um... What have we got here? We got, we've got no coal. There's no coal over here. Coal up there, but that don't matter. I'll tell you one thing I'm plan thinking of doing. Thinking of updating the avatar. If anyone, if anyone has any opinions on that. No idea what. No idea what it'll become. Maybe edit the air a bit. You know, stuff like that. Just, just to put it in your heads. If something changes, it's you know, you know, something's gonna change rather than oh, it's changed now, like I did in the Inca campaign.
you know, stuff like that. That's, you know, again, just a hint for something to come. Also, this Buddha, this little green Buddha we have in our attire, doing, he's working his bottom off in because we have had low karma for so long. We decrease it from taking provinces as well. Oh, that's... <laughs> no special favours. Because I am not spending any more admin points. Because we've spent enough as it is. <laughs> On all this deving and, you know. Uh, what is... Oh, we're at 25 now, we need an extra infantry. Because once we get once we get full of these, it's, it's dive yet time. Also, Ming is really not having a good time with them rebels. Ah, foreigner on the throne, that'll do it. Culture, Min. What culture is Ming? Wait, uh, is it in here? Wait, what's this state culture? Because their culture is Min. I don't know, it's probably Zili. Zili is probably the um, culture of Ming. Is it primary culture? All Chinese culture view Ming as their own nation, thus giving no penalties. Zili is not an. Oh, it's in us. I thought it was like, Zili is not an accepted culture in Ming. That would have been odd. Also, where do we have copper? We have copper in raid. That'd be that'd be a good one to dev. Uh, with dip points. Same with um, yeah, that silk and gems, which we already have. We already did gems, a little bit at least. Oh, but we can now. Oh no, <laughs> I thought I'd left um, the dev edict on, but but I am. Here we go. That's some. We'll sell that to Ming as well, maybe. That'll be Andy. Right. Next time I should be back once we've taken at least the majority of economic. I was gonna say this doesn't help. But it kinda does. Oh no, no it doesn't. Queen Regency. One admin. I thought we got our air, but we am. Soon though, two years. Two years and we'll have Ramaju on the phone. And they have six admin, which is a godsend. We're getting paid back for a karma there. Here we go, finally, Rama. 23 pretender rebels, there we go. Uh, you'll sort them out, yeah you will. Finally, we have 13 admin points a month. And industrious. That's, oh, I swear, pretender rebels. I hate them. I've, I've said this many times, you all know that I hate Pretender Rebels. Was it just, just impossible to fight against? Really annoy me, they do. And they always get, um, not protected, they always, um, get a retreat. All of the rebels don't retreat, but they're, except them ones. Them ones will keep fighting, and that annoys me. Because it's basically fighting your own troops, and they are able to retreat. Just annoys me, it does. Also, nobility, very unhappy. So I've got to give them something to make them happy. What are they like? I don't like supremacy of the crown because the states can pursue its genders at any time. Everyone, everyone gets loyalty, yeah, but it's not a fan. Land rights would be nice. Some governing capacity, give them that. An extra five percent, keep them just above. Here we go. This makes it easy to seize land and all. 
Oh, of course. Leader's is hard to find. Just press the magic button. The magic button cost 50, ad 50 arbitrary military points. Gives you a nice leader, or gives you a leader. Not necessarily a nice one. Gives you a leader. But yeah, we're working on economic. <laughs> Been honest. We're on this much for past like five years at least. Probably ten really. But 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 ah yes, saving money. We're saving money, not spending it all. Oh yeah, Ming, here you go, you have some. Go, stop spending money. Because we're trying to embrace the institution. It's spreading. It's spreading. It'll be re. Well, you know, I said I wanted to wait until we. Oh, I said I wanted to wait until we got all economic. Uh, Lanzang. This offensive or defensive? Attacker, right? Bugger to it. Bugger to it, right? You go up, and we're gonna put ourselves to the test against. No, we're not going to do that. You, there. We're going to put ourselves to the test against these. Against the AI. Lanzang's not going to give us out what we want. Because why would they? They're just our ally and everything. And we're not going to be able to embrace institution for a long time. Because all our money's going to go into this war. It's, you know, very kind of them to... um. Take all our money and force us to use it all up in a war against them. We're almost got Tech 10 though. So we'll stop losing innovativeness, which makes me a little bit happy at least. Also, they wanted me to build a manufacturing in Farabang. The only one I can build were Amparts. I mean, bloody hell. Trade in Malacca, but you go home during war. Um, yeah, so oh, thank God that fort was finished. Come, we'll come down and we'll have a go at them. Have a go with them and see what's, see who's who, see what's what, who's better, and all that. Here we go, mill tech, better cav, better cannons. I never know which one to pick because to me they both seem the same in terms of cannons because they're always on the back row or should be always on the back row. So defensive in shock and morale doesn't mean out to me. I don't know. I don't know. Federo, I guess, because if they do get on the front, you don't want them to lose morale or something. Yeah, it makes no, it makes little sense to me. Also, them boys are going away. Oh, so are they. Been fun to catch them in jungle. In jungle, jungle. We're gonna catch some though. Two stack. Two stack, but then no stack. I wonder, will we get out of this or will he take it all? He's gonna take it all, isn't he? How nice of him. Maybe we'll get some down here. Cause, I mean, if he gives it to us, we can't re we can't refuse, can we? We're just gonna have to take it and core it. So we're just gonna have to sit on as much land as we can get, aren't we? It's the only right thing to do. Here we go. All of South Vietnam. Aside from Champa. Because Vietnam has invaded that multiple times already. And, um, yeah, they've just not taken it. So, I mean, it's not up to me what they take. Right, how's this looking? Yeah, that's how I thought it was looking. Uh, we'll follow him back, back into Ming. 
but Bengal is run away. Them running away, no problem for me. But we got, you know, we got other things to deal with, like economic ideas, and the fact that we are very behind in tech. There we go, we got one. Caught him. Now we'll go round the all, all the way round. And we'll see if we can find them up here as well. Let's not Bengal out. Let's get rid of them. Also, very nice for um, Lanzang to hand over that land. No, they don't want that. I wonder if we can get him to give us it. And then separate piece. So we don't need to be friends with Lanzang. Ooh. Never mind. <laughs> uh, but also never mind. Because, you know, siege him out up here, make a bit of money off Bengal, and then we'll bugger off. Take some stuff from Divia. Oh. Oh, yeah, they got a lot more heavies. Run away! We lost a heavy. Yeah. Ah, well. Uh, what can you do? Other than end the episode, apparently, because it is time. I thought you was level two. Yeah, it is time. Uh, thank you all for watching. Hope you pre uh, hope you uh, enjoyed. I do appreciate people who watch and enjoy what I make. Cause it, you know, makes me more confident in uh, talking to everyone and um, public speaking in general. That's, that's what this whole thing's about. But yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll um, see everyone in the next episode. Goodbye.